All right, we're back. I got the metal to make the base for the new PM45 milling machine. And uh, here's the project for today. Uh, what I plan on doing, well, first of all, let me mention the piece of bar material that my friend sold me, we ran a little short. So he only had a piece of one by three. All this material is uh, uh, one by four and a half. So I happen to have a one by one bar in my storage. So I'm going to um, just extend that one piece so we're all concentric with all the other corners. So basically I'm gonna be putting a leveling pad like that one on all four corners and then this stand the PM45 stand basically attaches in the middle one on each side and that's a half inch hole so basically what I'm going to do is uh, lay that up and that's going to this is going to bolt to the basic stand right there and then I'm going to have four leveling points um, in each corner. Um, I'm going 24 inches wide. It's going to overlap um, an inch in the front and an inch in the back and about uh, three inches on each side. So that ought to make a pretty darn stable base. So that's the plan. Today I'm going to prep all the material. Um, I'm going to v-groove all my butt welds uh, so that way I have some good penetration and a nice smooth uh, weld base. So, uh, got to cut that piece of one by and get it ready to attach to that one by three and uh, we'll go from there. Okay, I got it roughed out. Uh, basically, this is how I'm going to fit the pieces. So I got them all labeled, um, how I'm going to fit it up. And now I'm going to mark um, where the holes are going to go and center punch them and then after that I think I'm going to uh, start creating the uh, V's and the valleys for the weld joints. Alright, I got all of the uh, little channels ground in to my joints and all the uh, butt ends cleaned up so I should uh, end up with some nice clean welds. I uh, got the welder set up uh, I got to get my helmet and uh, start tacking this up. Uh, just do a little bit at a time so I don't tweak anything. Um, so just a little status update here. All right, just threw a couple uh, quick hot uh, tacks on there with the Millermatic 185, and uh, looking pretty good. The thing turned out pretty square. Um, good thing I took a measurement of that base again because I had to move that center support down uh, half an inch to be centered on that uh, mounting uh, bracket right there. So we're good to go. So I got my front top set going. Uh, going to let that cool off a little bit and then I'm going to flip it over and, and tack them. And then I'm going to go to town and weld it up. Make her pretty. Here's the base all welded up. And uh, now I'm getting ready to uh, cut the holes marked out for the leveling pads and the mounting uh, holes. Oh, I've got to drill them and uh, got to drill them through one inch plate so it may take me a while but there it is uh, getting closer. <laughs> 